So I set up these two pieces of tape that tell you exactly what angle the lead screw has rotated to uh, against a neutral reference. So for instance, if I go up one millimeter, that's a half turn of the shaft, down one millimeter, half turn of the shaft, etc. Now, my bed is currently not tightened. If I level, it always returns to the exact same position, which is currently marked two or zero since it's two, ro two millimeters per rotation. Um, if I tighten this down, the Mars will not return to the same zero on leveling. See how it's showing one. And that's because the force on this arm tilting it up actually engages, hits the end stop early. So if I loosen this back up again, I'll show you. So just to show you I'm not crazy, we're gonna re-zero it, it'll go back down to two or zero. So this is true zero. Now if I hold this up, we don't return to zero. Simply applying a force will do the trick. And the force is not directly sensed. Now we can tell that is actually true because the beeps happen whenever the end stop sensor gets hit. So if I simply pull up on this guy enough, I can trigger the end stop sensor without even commanding a move. So I zeroed the bed at true zero, but it's currently stopping one millimeter high. So let's see what happens if we go run a print. First thing it does is zero the bed and it's zeroing the bed one millimeter high. Now this is sliced at 50 microns a layer. So we should see this on the next layer go slightly above that one millimeter. So that was the peel. Then on the next layer, it stops 50 microns above one millimeter.